Hello, and we are back. Okay, so um, two quick notes. One, I highly and deeply apologize for the uh, the stupid audio on uh, on the previous episode. I'm pretty sure you guys have heard it. Uh, yeah, that was pretty stupid on my end. I put the gain up too high, and as you may know, if you watched the previous episode. Um, it was it was a disaster. I mean, the second episode. I mean, the third episode. As you can see, I was able to uh, uh, bring things around, and the audio was fine. I would say it was perfect, but um, no more um, recording recording foibles on my end. Uh, everything was probably just from post editing. Uh, but yeah, um, I finally figured out the proper setting for my microphone and for my uh, recording application and my voice should be fine from here on in and yeah instead of going back there I want to do this first because I'm pretty sure yep there we go this should do exactly uh, what the thing from uh, the catacombs did you know this is probably gonna turn into a ladder Yes, it is. Okay. Alright. Where the hell did I end up? Oh yeah, and I also removed the... Um, I removed the shield and I put on the Havel string because I forgot. This is kind of a heavy set. And I started fat rolling when I started the game. Yeah. yeah. Hello there. Oh! Oh! Woo! That was close. That would have been great for recording, huh? Jeez. Dead end. Let's continue on down here. This is gonna be a bitch to do. Oh! Is someone... Oh! Someone's shooting at me. This, yeah, this is exactly what I needed. God damn it. Crystal Lizard! Come here. No! It's a trap! Are you shooting at me, bro? Are you shooting at me, bro? Yes, you are. Fuck you. Ember. Eh, that's fine. Never, you could never go wrong with free embers. Free embazu. Mm. Whoo! That was close. I don't know where the hell I'm going. No, 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 no. I almost fell. I felt like I almost fell, and I can feel the rock coming to my face. Yep. Okay. Let's... Fuck you, man. Nope, not today. Let's do this downstairs, shall we? Because I have no room to fight you in there. Come on, bro. I'm wearing your set. No! Oh, God damn. He, he, he's pissed. He's pissed. Wow, that, that rock. That rock. I am stuck. I was stuck. God damn. Okay. Fuck. Ah. Jeez. Alright, let's rush. Let's rush back. I know exactly where to go. The, uh, no, the bridge probably resets, so I need to... I need to hit it again and wait for that. Oh god, I got geometry fucked. I got geometry fucked right there.
Yeah, bridge is back. That sucks. Waiting for the bridge. Just waiting for the bridge. Just gonna meditate while waiting for the bridge. That should be fine. Down here is going to be one guy. Yep. I'm just going to go ahead and skip some of these. Oh! God damn, that was beautiful. Holy shit, that was beautiful. Okay, I am gonna. Uh, uh, yeah, I'll meet you guys there. Alright, let's continue this. Ah, oh, that was a bitch. But yeah, that's what I deserve. Uh, that's what I get for rushing. For a second. Oh, okay. Well, at least I got something out of that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, these guys are probably gonna chase me down, so. Yeah. And just deal with these guys. Yep. That was close. And yeah. Yeah, got him before he had his shield up. Yeah, fuck you. Gotcha. Oh, it's not a rock, it's an exploding arrow. That's great. And he can still reach me from down here. That means he's somewhere from a um, good vantage point. Okay, there has to be something special down here. I can see that crab. I am not gonna go to that crab just yet. Let's, uh, let's go around here, shall we? Nope. Praise the are you ready? Okay, this looks like a uh, point of no return, so let's go ahead and meet that crab. Bonfire! Okay, I am so blind. That would have been so dumb. That would have been so dumb if I went down and died and just completely skipped that bonfire. Hello, crab. More crabs! Oh, shit. Oh shit, this is a problem. Oh god, I can't believe that other one aggroed. That's bullshit. It, that's bullshit. That the other one aggroed and they're so fast. Okay, this is one of my biggest problems with Dark Souls 3. Is that, um... The enemies... Uh, move and hit as fast as Bloodborne, but the healing is not Bloodborne speed. In Bloodborne, the moment you press uh, the the vial button, it the character just does this one motion and he heals instantly. But this is Bloodborne enemy speed with classic Dark Souls Estus, and it's a bad combination. It's a bad combo. Very bad combo. Do not do combo.
Uh, well, at least, at least there's a bonfire right here. Although, since I didn't sit down, I might go back to the church. Nah, that just means double loading screen. That means more intimate time with you guys. Nope. Okay. Let's do this right. Let's, uh, let's do this right. Oh, I do not have any great bow stuff, do I? Oh, there we go. Mm, yeah. Yeah, there we go. Come over here. Let's do this one on one. Don't bring your friend. Watch me still get wrecked, huh? Yeah, that looks like it might just happen. Okay, fuck you. Honestly, they're not as tough as uh, their counterparts from the Fire and Keep perimeter, but there's still a problem though. Next one, where are you? I know you're right here. You're not that bad when you're alone. Yeah, fuck you. Crystal gem, okay. I mean, I'm never gonna use it, but at least it dropped. More trees. Let's deal with this one first. Eh, bitch! What? It's alive! It's alive! Oh, there it goes. I thought it was gonna grab me. It, it, it was about to do its command grab. Definitely. Can I? Yep. Yeah, bitch. You stupid trees. He's gonna do a command grab, isn't he? This one's already awake, isn't it? Whoa, it's moving! What the fuck is that? That's mute, snap freeze. Uh, I'm safe, so let's check that out. Snap freeze. Snap freeze. Okay. One of the spells left behind by the young sorcerer Sullivan before leaving the painted world. Oh, that's right, Sullivan is from here. Creates a cloud of near freezing mist. Sullivan was born and raised inside the painting, yet had little use for this frigid homeland, since he had not yet experienced loss. Okay. I still need to watch that Sullivan video by Vadi. Is this a dead end? This is a dead end. Yep. Okay. So down to that uh that cliff, the point of no return looking. There's a ladder. Holy shit, I didn't see that. Okay, let's check out that ladder first. <laughs> a Wait. That's impossible. How did I not see that before? Did this just come down? I am going to look at my footage. I swear this wasn't here. I swear this wasn't here. Who put it down then? And why? And how? I'm just gonna slap on the uh, the snake eater theme. <laughs> I'm still 
in a dream. Snake eater. Bow, 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 bow. Uh, quite long. Was this in a... Was this in Indie Mouse's uh, best ladders video? Or was that video before Ashes of Ariandel came out? Because that was a long ladder. And this might be too, I didn't bother to check. Yeah, it's a lot. This, is this just gonna bring me back to the top of the mountain? If it is, I'm just, I'm gonna be pissed. Because this was, would have been worthless. Holy crap, it did. It did. Wait, oh! Oh, it brought me back, but you couldn't have reached this spot normally from that other side, and that was a slab, and that was worth it. Okay. I'm not gonna walk back. I have this infinite... Uh, infinite... Homeward. I'm just gonna use it. That would have been a waste of time. But holy shit! Slab! That's one free slab. And um, you get to buy one slab from the Captain's Ashes, so that's two slabs this early on in Ashes of Ariando. They're being, uh, they're being very generous with the slabs, actually. I think I'm s with those two. Oh wait, well with that, I'm gonna be I'm sitting on ten. Yeah, and with the one that I can buy, that's gonna be eleven slabs. When I find a good weapon, I didn't really like the axe or the javelin, but when I find a good weapon, I can definitely switch. No problemo. Uh, let's do this. Flowers. Is this a lunar tear? Yeah. How about that near, huh? There has to be something here. Something's gonna come out. Come on. This is this is a boss arena. You're not gonna tell me there's no. Oh, yep. That boss arena. And I'm about to run out of batteries. Wait, how many how many are there gonna be? He's already right here. Let me kill your pupper first. Okay, now I can focus on you. And that was a bad roll, that was a bad roll. Okay, let's see what you have. Why does he have that uh that icon? Inside his name. Fuck. This is a human, isn't it? Like, this is a proper human enemy type. Oh! Crap. Okay, wow, he's using guard parries, isn't he? using as in um, fighting game oh shit great tender great wolf so if you don't kill him fast enough oh shit that was for real okay that bonfire spot makes sense because this is gonna be a bitch fight okay so you need to rush that You clearly need to rush that because that that's brutal. I might have to switch uh nah I think my act is doing a good enough job. Alright. Uh kill the puppers fast. 
and kill the guy fast because that wolf is gonna be a problem if I don't uh, if I don't kill them fast enough. Pupper? Pupper, alright. Let's deal with you quick. So, since I can break his guard, I'm just gonna spam that. Because I need to kill him quick. Oh, it's dependent on his health. Okay. Let's deal with this pupper. I'm gonna do this now. Because I think I'm gonna need the extra bit of health. Oh! Oh! This is the thing that's been hunting me all game. He's not that strong. Oh shit! Okay, I take that back. That was a bitch move. He's calling wolves, isn't he? Whoa! Whoa, this is awesome! One more? Yeah! Alright. We do it! We do it! Champion's Bones and the Valor Heart. Check that out first. Uh, what is that Champion's Bone? Mm, key item? Okay. Burn at Firelink Shrine to unlock undead matches. Oh, this is a PvP thing. Okay. The char but warm bones of a champion. Burn at the Firelink Shrine bonfire to participate in undead matches. Yeah, this is a PvP thing. But I think people have moved on to the Ring City, so I don't know if this is still relevant. Yeah. Long ago, an undead declared a fight. A fight to celebrate their undeath and to preserve what remained of their souls. So it was that the undead matches were born. The merit of an undead is measured in deaths. Could there be a greater gift for such a creature than a fight that has no end? Yeah, this is a PvP thing, definitely. Let's check out that Valor Heart, shall we? That looks interesting. Okay, Special Straight Sword. Okay. Weapon once wielded by the champion of the undead match. A special paired set consisting of a broadsword and a lion shield. The champion fought on without rest until he lost his mind. In the end, only his page and the lone wolf stayed at his side. Also, that was not the champion of Undead Match. No, that I fought. Lion Stance. While in stance, use normal attacks to thrust forward with shield up, and strong attack to execute the shield bash with a lion's roar. I want to check that out. Okay. I'm just going to go ahead and equip that. So it's a free shield. Oh, this is a special move set. Whoa, this is interesting. Okay. Stance. This is a blocking strike. This is what he was doing to me. He was doing a guard parry. There's a bonfire right there. And the R2. Whoa! Is that a guard break? I wanna I wanna check this out. I wanna check this out. Like for real. Read me oh, this is nothing. Let there be rescue. Joy. 
Wow, Joy on a grave? Are you fucking rubbish ahead? Oh! Anyway, I'll pay my respects. Oh, I thought I thought I would have the shield. Oh well. Yeah, I wanna I wanna try this out. So uh, let's go to a let's go to a weak area and check that out, shall we? Before we end this session. Just gonna make sure I don't miss anything. Doesn't look like it. Hey, it's my souls that. I have nothing on it. Yeah, let's go to a weak area and check that weapon out. Because I'm interested in maxing that. I It's been a long time since I used a sword and shield combo. I think I stopped using a sword and shield ever since Bloodborne came out. So, this... That's an interesting sword and shield, and it might bring me back to that, uh, to that fighting style. So, let's just check that out. I want to burn this first, though. Burn champion's bones. Oh, you can just select a PvP thing right here. That's awesome. You don't have to, uh, you don't have to put down a red, uh, red soapstone sign to start an undead match, I guess. So that's awesome. Anyway, let's go back to the cemetery. Looks uh, too weak of a spot, so let's try. Um, let's try the foot of the high wall, I guess. I just want to try out the Valor Heart because that's interesting. I want to check that out. It looks like it's gonna be more of a PvP weapon. So I want to see how viable it actually is in PvE before I slap on a slab on it. Uh, just, just want to check. Oh right, I forgot that the eclipse started already. Oh, you can just go ahead and equip the shield for the stance. Okay, I'm curious. Oh, this is the wrong area, but whatever. Should be fine. I'm curious. Um, even if I'm not holding the the shield on my left, if I use the stance, does it count as a block? Because if it counts as a block, oh, my, oh no, oh, it's not a, it's not a perfect block. What about here? It's not. Is it not 100% physical? If it's not, then that's uh, that's unfortunate. If seriously, it's not 100% physical. It's only 60. This is kind of unfortunate. Why would you have uh, a sword and shield combo when uh, you're not even 100% physical reduction? This is kind of... Uh, kind of... Yeah, this is definitely uh, a, a PvP weapon because you wouldn't be... Um, you wouldn't be trading those, uh, those non, what, that, those non 100% physical reduction attacks. So, as good as the moveset is, that's a PvP weapon, definitely. And I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna be using that for now. Because, uh, I'm not gonna be doing any PvP stuff that much. 